Okay, this is just another quick little video. If you have book sales from your library in your area, you should really go to book sales because I have here... <laughs> I, I've been to two book sales in the past two years, going to a third one this September, and this is all the swag I was able to acquire uh, from those book sales. This, Let's start with the stuff that I got from last year's book sale. Uh, at Jurassic Park classic for here from uh, Michael Crichton and Pirate Latitudes another novel from Michael Crichton <laughs> this is just seriously good stuff I mean if you can go to a book sale and get this kind of stuff for cheap uh, Star Wars Last Command Dark Force Rising from the three book cycle that began with the book that I don't have from this uh, Rogue Planet another one Splinter of the Mind. That's not Splinter of the Mind's Eye. Splinter of the Mind's Eye. You know, Rogue Squadron. Book one of Star Wars X Wing Rogue Squadron. Shadows of the Friggin' Empire. This is a damn good book. Uh, and you have these. Book two, Mission from Mount Yoda, Queen of the Empire, Prophets of the Dark Side. Book one, Glove of Darth Vader, Lost City of the Jedi, Zorba the Hut's Revenge. And Ravenloft, Vampire of the Mists. You gotta love that. And of course, this one, uh, Saturn's Children. Hot, uh, female android on the cover. Awesomeness. So this is all stuff that I got at last year's, uh, book sale. Lafayette Parish, Friends of the Library. Good stuff. And this year, I was able to go back on a member's night and get more. I got three manga. Neon Genesis Evangelion. Which, uh, Served as a major inspiration for Pacific Rim, which is out in theaters right now. Cowboy Bebop, Volume 3 and Volume 1. Awesomeness. I got a new copy of The Hobbit because mine was falling up. This isn't like the one that I had. This one's kind of thinner and it has a different cover. Because the one I originally had was falling apart. And I also got Fellowship of the Ring because my copy of that was also falling apart. Uh, Mac Boland, Diplomacy Directive. From the Executioner series by Mac Bolan. Or Don Pendleton. Sorry, Mac Bolan's the character. Battletech Field Manual for Federated Sons. I thought this was going to be better than it was. Well, it's not bad, but uh, it's not good either. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's it's kind of interesting. Uh, the, the Unofficial X-Files Companion Volume. These are from the UK because the price is listed in pounds or euros. Uh, X-Files, Unofficial Companions, Volumes 1 and 3, and the Lexicon, Anti-Waltons to Zoonies. <laughs> you gotta love that. And they even had tapes. And they also had one other thing from that book sale. Actually, they had six other things that I got this year's book sale. This is Tomorrow Never Dies, one of my favorite James Bond movies, right after GoldenEye and the Daniel Craig stuff. And I also got Rayman, which I can't play, I don't think, anymore. They had a CD case for Tomb Raider, but it was a small soldier's game, so I didn't get it. And, of course, the, cre the crown jewel. I almost said cream of the crop. Same basic thing. Crown jewel of this year's book, fair pur book sale purchases. Doctor Who novels. The target novelization of Ghost Light. Recommended retail price. Ghost Light, so Doctor. Set piece... Love and War, Nightshade by Mark Gattis, who is currently writing for the show. I think he actually guest starred on the show for the episode uh, as Dr. Lazarus. Let me turn to that giant thing. Uh, Lucifer Rising, and Deceit. Six friggin' Doctor Who novels. And again, I'm going to the book sale again this year. Don't know what I'm going to find. Hopefully it'll be good. So if your local library has a book sale, go to it. You may find some awesome, awesome stuff. I mean, this year, I actually passed up a copy of Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas by Hunter S. Thompson, the one earlier this year. Hopefully, I can go back and get it in September. And, I mean, there was a Dungeons & Dragons thing. There was there was all kinds of great stuff. And they had vinyl records. They had. It's just book sales in general for libraries are awesome. And I mean, I might even find some more of it. Actually, I did get one other thing at last year's book sale. 
which you may have remembered from <laughs> my video, my video series on my book collection, uh, Rainbow Six Gold Edition Strategy Guide. So yeah, if I find anything like this uh, this year for other games and stuff, I'll get it. So yeah, if your local library has a book sale, go to it and get stuff because book sales are awesome. But yeah, if you go to book sales, buy stuff, they're awesome. They're just awesome.